There's no place in the world like Paris. But come Christmas time, the famed City of Lights takes its nickname pretty literally. With the entire city decked out in lights, Christmas markets popping up all over, and plenty of excuses to eat your weight in chocolate, here are some of the best things you need to do in Paris at Christmas time. Stay till the end because we're saving the best for last, and I'll even be giving you a free checklist and map with all these spots. So, the number one thing to do in Paris at Christmas is to frolic your way through the city's Christmas markets. While most Christmas markets wait until after Advent to make their grand appearance, a few are usually open earlier. During my visit, I had the chance to visit the Christmas market at the Jardin des Tuileries and the Christmas market at La Défense. Sandwiched between the Louvre Museum and Place de la Concorde, the Jardin des Tuileries offers a centrally located Christmas wonderland, with over 100 wooden chalets selling everything from gluttonous munchies to handcrafted gifts. For thrill seekers, you'll find fairground rides and games on site, as well as a giant Ferris wheel overlooking the city. And hey, if you play your cards right, you might even make a few new friends. On the outskirts of Paris, at the end of the Metro Line 1, you'll find La Défense, a sprawling business center that showcases a whole, whole, whole new modern side to Paris. While there's not usually a reason to visit this spot as a tourist, Christmas is the perfect time to go, because the district is home to Paris's largest Christmas market, with over 300 different stalls, a variety of beautiful light installations, and of course, plenty of caloric goodness. I even spotted a Canadian food stall, so if you want to add some poutine to your routine, that's something you can do. Sure, it's a little out of the way, but if you want a great Christmas market experience in Paris, be sure to stop by this one. Your second Christmas must-do in Paris is to enjoy all the Christmas magic at Gallery Lafayette, a luxurious department store with a show-stopping Christmas tree that dazzles the masses every year. And if that's not sparkly enough as is, there's even a light show every 30 minutes that you can enjoy. As well as a variety of Christmas decor scattered around the store's multiple floors. And for the first time ever, the Gallery Lafayette have also unveiled a new rooftop skating rink this year, which is 100% free, including use of the rink and rentals. This of course means you can glamorously glide around with Eiffel Tower views for free. If you lack coordination like me though, you might not break the bank, but you will probably break your hips. Next up, don't forget to enjoy the different Christmas shops and displays around the city. Paris at Christmas is like the city of lights on glittery steroids. Storefronts are decked out, restaurants are twinkling, and countless streets will be lined with dazzling lights, including the iconic Champs-Élysées. A few spots you can't miss for lights include the Village Royale, this year home to giant glittery bears and balloons. Place Vendôme, home to big towering Christmas trees surrounded by some of the most luxurious brands in the world. And of course, the quintessentially Parisian Rue Montegoy, a charming market street lined with bakeries, cheese shops, and cafes. You'll even find the oldest patisserie in Paris lurking on the street, in operation since the year 1730. The fourth must do during Christmas in Paris is to stop by the incredible covered passages of the city, one of my favorite quirky gems in Paris. These covered shopping arcades date back to the early 19th century, and a few dozen remain today, offering an intimate setting for all sorts of beautiful shops, cafes, and restaurants. While already a delightful step in time on any given day, these passages become especially wonderful at Christmas time, when twinkly lights and yuletide decor crank the magic meter to over 9,000. Galerie Vivienne is probably the most famous of these passageways, and for good reason. With ornate mosaic tiling and a bright glass rooftop, this passage becomes only more magical during Christmas time with all its amazing lights. My personal favorite for Christmas, though, is a little boutique tucked away inside Passage du Froid, the Maison du Roi, a Baroque shop showcasing all kinds of wonders reminiscent of the 18th century. At Christmas time too, the displays here are pretty tough to beat. 
Next up, another incredible must-do in Paris during Christmas is, of course, to drink your weight in hot chocolate. I mean, sure, there's no bad time to be enjoying hot chocolate in Paris, but there's something very, very special about the Christmas spirit engulfing the city that seems to give you a free pass to not count calories and to indulge, indulge, indulge. Angelina is a Parisian institution that many love for their thick drinking chocolate and elegant tea room. But if I can be honest, my taste buds far prefer the delicious hot chocolate at the Lit Cafe. Is it the most Parisian experience? Not exactly, but trust me when I say I would take a bullet for this hot chocolate if I could. Try one with whipped cream and your life will be changed. And while hot chocolate does truly course through my veins at Christmas time, there's good news if you're looking for something a little bit stronger. That brings me to number six, which is to grab a drink at one of Paris's many Christmassy terraces and bars. A little known Christmas secret of Paris is that many of the city's fanciest hotels and terraces will be rolling out Christmas pop-ups where you can booze up in a festive and enchanting atmosphere. From an igloo bar on the Eiffel Tower to cozy chalets at the Ritz and Park Hyatt, one of the best ways to warm up after a long day of sightseeing is a scenic drink in a sparkly, festive venue. My personal recommendation? Le Perchois at the BHV Marais, a rooftop bar on top of one of Paris's most famous department stores. This is one of the top hotspots in the city during the summer, but it's also open in the wintertime with beautiful lights and, of course, one of the top views in town. And perhaps the most dazzling light show that Paris has to offer. 